the one who was rejected became the capstone or the cornerstone maybe you are facing a uh, rejection in your life maybe you are facing somebody who is above you maybe your boss maybe you are going through some kind of rejection by your own family all for the sake of the gospel you have been rejected god will turn the things around and he says you will become a capstone in that same place you will become an important cornerstone maybe if you are given god has given you a task he has given you a ministry he has given you something in the hand to do something faithfully and god is calling us to turn back and do it faithfully this month this is lord's doing that means only god can do that in your life only god can do that in your life and my life and it is a marvelous thing in your eyes that's why the word of god says you are not the tail but you are the head you are not below but you are the above amen hallelujah and i'm telling you this month is going to be a month of god's power amen hey friends greetings to every one of you in the name of our lord and savior jesus christ welcome into this month of november i'm very glad to meet you in this way to give you the promise that god has given us for this month of november how faithful our god is amen in meeting us in the needs that we have and faithfully promising us in the days to come what we ought to go through and we get encouraged for this month even as i was waiting upon the lord for the month of november the promise that god gives to us is taken from this gospel of mark chapter 12 verse 10 to 11 the word of god says jesus speaking have you not even read this scripture the stone which the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone the stone which the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone this was the lord's doing and it is marvelous in our eyes this was the lord's doing and it is marvelous in our eyes hallelujah a month of marvel a month of god's marvel that's what god is promising us for this month amen i was very glad to receive it from the lord and as i was uh, meditating on it these are few things that i just want to uh, tell you to encourage you and to exhort you amen we have passed 11 months uh, uh 10 months and we have come into this 11th month and you know the word of god says jesus looking at the uh, at the people and he says the stone which the builders rejected you know at times when we go through life there is rejection that we have to face and we are rejected by people we are rejected by situation we are rejected by circumstance we are rejected by people above us maybe family members but the lord wants to tell don't worry your rejection is going to be turned into acceptance in this month what was rejected god is going to change it to the acceptance and in fact it he says has become the chief cornerstone that means that which was considered insignificant is going to be made as significant hallelujah amen and i tell you that is the promise that the lord wants to tell in fact in this parable if you see when you notice jesus is talking about a owner he goes on to tell his people about this parable and that there was a owner of a vineyard and he is going off to a far off land and he is leasing his vineyard to the vine dresser okay vine dresser and the vine dresser is basically a manager or a steward and uh, when the right time came to you know uh, for the wine to bear fruit and to take those yieldings he is sending people his servants and this wine dresser instead of giving and uh, faithfully what the master has given to him he beats them and uh, he chases them finally you know in a few occasions he does so and then the owner of the wine yard he is sending his own son and uh, what these people did is he they took the son 
in fact uh, they killed him and uh, in that context in which uh, jesus is talking this parable in fact this is talking about the jews his own people rejecting jesus christ the one who was rejected became the capstone or the cornerstone amen and in that context jesus is saying the stone that the builder rejected has become the chief cornerstone isn't it that means jesus being the picture of the mankind that you and i when we are rejected we have the potential and god is going to change the situation around and he is going to turn around the situation for you to make you the capstone or the cornerstone that's why the word of god says you are not the tail but you are the head you are not below but you are the above amen hallelujah i i believe even as you receive this word and i'm telling you this month is going to be a month of god's marvel in your life amen amen praise the lord so this parable as jesus was rejected he was rejected on your behalf on my behalf think about that so that we can be accepted in the lord and that is what god wants to tell us at this month my friend amen maybe you're facing a uh, rejection in your life maybe you're facing somebody who is above you maybe your boss maybe you're going through some kind of a rejection by your own family all for the sake of the gospel you are being rejected or just because you have jesus in you you're being rejected i want to tell you that god will turn the things around and he says you will become a capstone in that same place you will become an important cornerstone do you know the cornerstone is an important one in the building that holds the entire arch or maybe the corners so that is what god will call you to be amen and i believe uh, this is a very wonderful promise that god is giving us amen suddenly he gives a, a warning you know it also says in the other other sense the wine dresser who was misusing the master's property maybe if you are given god has given you a task he has given you a ministry he has given you something in the hand to do something faithfully and god is calling us to turn back and do it faithfully in this month we are coming to the end of this year let us reflect on the things that god has given in our hands have we been faithful or have we mistreated that let's come back to that and go back my son my daughter and ask god lord change me amen change me praise the lord finally you see that this is lord's doing everyone say lord's doing amen lord's doing that means only god can do that in your life only god can do that in your life and my life and it is a marvelous thing in your eyes the word of god says that means every eyes that sees you will see that marvel of god hallelujah even as you believe even as you receive this word you will see that happening in every moment there is a rejection you will see the marvel of god take taking place in your life hallelujah that's what i want to uh, tell you and encourage you and that's what i believe god is speaking to us in this month amen if you believe with me this month to be a month of uh, a marvel god's marvel would you close your eyes with me and let's pray and uh, god will bless this month of marvel amen father we praise you in the name of a uh, a lord jesus christ your wonderful son and our savior and our master lord we pray that father god every one who is under the breath of my voice who is listening to this promise lord we pray that you will reveal your marvelous work in their life in every rejection that they will go through in every kind of uh, dejection that they may uh, uh, face father god i pray that lord you will change the situation that the the stone that was rejected by the builders has become the cornerstone you will elevate your children you will lift them up in the same place you will exalt them in the same place this month father god i beseech you in the name of our uh, lord and savior that your children will see and not only they will see but the people who will watch them they will see that your work is marvelous in their sight we praise you we give you glory in the name of our lord jesus christ we pray and the people of god said amen and amen hallelujah praise the lord praise the lord i believe you are blessed and continue to be blessed stay blessed and be blessed and enjoy this one god bless you all